The facility will endeavor to deliver effective information to exporters and importers on the conditions of accessing the European market. The center harnesses information and communication technology to enable easy access to market information by the business communities, including SMEs. It is expected this will open opportunities to conduct business with high-value markets using handheld devices, including cell phones. This information center is not only for Zimbabwean entrepreneurs, Zimbabwean exporters to get information about the market in the European Union. It's also a center that will serve for investors from the European Union, industrialists from the European Union, to get reliable information about Zimbabwe and not only what usually certain media say about this poor country, in order to make sure that when they make a decision of investment, they make an informed decision. The export help desk. The European market is now open to all the products from Zimbabwe. The center is aimed at increasing capacity of Zimbabwean business operators to establish mutually beneficial ties with their EU counterparts. International Trade Center Director Arancha Gonzalez says the Zimbabwean government should invest more in small to medium enterprises. Investing in SMEs is not just the right thing to do, it's also the smart thing to do. It is so from a strictly economic point of view, but also from a social point of view. SMEs are the employers of many thousands, many million of women. They are the employers of many, many youth. Uh, and this is why it's a particular pleasure for us to be associated with this project as, a, as the implementer of this project, because we strongly believe this project is a very useful tool in the hands of a small and medium enterprises to translate these opportunities arising from the um, economic and partnership. A survey done in 2012 shows that small businesses can double the job opportunities in the country if properly harnessed. During the year in review, statistics indicate 800,000 small businesses had employed 2.9 million people. Mahemutwa CCTV.